I might be like the world's oldest Mouseketeer. <laughs> M-I-C-K-E-Y-M-O-U-S-E, -E, Mickey Mouse. Could you imagine? Rosie is a busty little Mouseketeer out there. Woo! Stop the presses. Hey, everybody. It is Thursday morning, March 5th, 2020. Welcome to all of you. I thought I hope that your Thursday is off to a fantastical start. You know, I'm pledged every day to try to bring, put a smile on your face and find some things that uh, you'll laugh or get a real chuckle out of. And also some things that are very unusual, some crap you don't see every day. Okay, maybe you've seen it before, but probably you haven't. And I've gotten a lot of good feedback on the, uh, the direction I've been going for the last six weeks ago. Well, anyway, I was watching the other day, and, uh, you know, how many of us have, have not gotten, in, gotten into a fight with a co-worker? You know, somebody might steal your chicken salad out of the office refrigerator, or nip some of your coffee, or, you know, anyone to take your tissues, your silver, any number of things that people do. Even grab your Snickers bar. I was hungry. What, I'm sorry, you know. Well, sometimes sorry doesn't cut it. That's the problem when you're co-workers, especially if you have a rather long history together. And uh, this link that I have down below is particularly worth watching. When I first started watching this clip, and this clip is about, I imagine, about 20 years old, maybe. And I first started watching, I'm like, ah, oh, this ain't going to get real good. But then in the last 20, 30 seconds, it got really good. <laughs> I mean, it got really good. You could tell there was a lot of bitterness between these uh, co-workers. And, uh, well, you've got to see how it came out in the end. I'll give you a little bit of a teaser. Imagine that you're an anchor man for the news in uh, Manhattan, New York City. You know, you got the number one market in the United States, and you got a field reporter that you've worked with for many, many years. You know him well. Hell, he even used to be your boss, right? And uh, let's just say he kind of uh, doesn't do the reporting in the field that you think uh, should be done. A little bit below par in the uh, reporting, well, these two guys go at it on the air, and the results are really hilarious. And to have this play out in front of the uh, in front of the television audience watching the news that night must have been absolutely epic. I just wish I'd been there watching it live. I would have called everybody in the world, man, yeah, 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 did you see that on the TV? Anyway, click it in the description box down below and enjoy. I'd like to see your uh, feedback. If you ever got into it with somebody at work, or what do you think about these two goofballs, these two pros? <laughs> All right, everybody. Happy Thursday.